that wind's probably gonna pick up. Got a little thing I built here. Let's start it with this and then vaulted that one over there. And now I'm gonna try this one. Got a little bit better. It's a what I call a ballistics rail. And basically it's for you know trying out, you know, you don't bullet catches, <clears throat> you wanna do the water catch, you wanna have things lined up in front of it, and um you know, shooting through fruit, whatever, seeing different expansion, penetration tests, things like that. You can even do, you know, like we got the waterboarding. I mean, it's, it's several different tests you can do off of one, one of these, and uh, you know, it came up something you can change out really easy after you get done shot, clean it out, put the next one in, keep going. But I started out with a low, this one right here with just two by sixes, and it's like, you know what, I'm going to go with uh, one by tens. They'll be a little bit higher, you know, if the bullet does stray or whatever, it's going to hit the floors and slow it down else you know keeping everything safe well I went with this but instead when I went over there I'll show you a picture in a second it split it just it blew it apart I mean it's just that that water has so much pressure when it blows out these jugs higher caliber bullets it was splitting the boards and uh, splitting everything apart and basically ripping it up the expansion with the water so what I did was I added these uh, one by tens on the outside and then I drilled several ports along the side roughly lining up with the water jugs and then on the bottom so whenever it, that water explodes hopefully this will be enough pressure release shooting out these holes to keep it from actually not ripping this up and uh, and then I also with the one by on the uh, outer on the outside I screwed that in so that would also help hopefully keep the wood from the two by tens from splitting but this is just a idea I came up with like I said there's several different tests all different kind of penetration tests you want to do water catches you know line it up with all different kind of things um, like you know, if you're, you know, in your backyard shooting, things like that. Now, this ain't an alternative. It ain't, don't make sure, you know, whatever's behind you, make sure you got to stop. You got that safe zone back there behind you. So if this is just, this will slow things down. But if a bullet veers off like a 308 round, it's going to plow through this shit and keep going. Things like that. That's what full metal jackets will do. Yeah, but mostly we're doing, you know, ballistic tips, uh, hollow points, things like that, handgun loads. This is really well for handgun loads, even the small ones. Like I said, this is just a quick look. It evolved from this to this, so we're gonna see how this works out and see what it does, and I'm probably drawing this video out too long. It's probably like a six minute video, but by the time y'all see it, it'll be a two minute video, and nothing will make sense. Thanks for watching.